This is Living Power with Dan Hurst. The 15th prophecy was that his body would be pierced with a spear. His body would be pierced with a spear. Prophecy came in uh, somewhere around 520 to 518 B.C. in Zechariah. And I will pour out on the house of David and the inhabitants of Jerusalem a spirit of grace and pleas for mercy, so that when they look on me, on whom they have pierced, they shall mourn for him. Now, by the way, I find it interesting in this prophecy that he moves from when they look on me, they shall mourn for him. Isn't that interesting? It's, it's really a confirmation that the Messiah would be God, that Jesus would be God. And so uh, God's speaking to this. He said that when they look on him, they will, they will, when they look on me hanging on the cross, they'll mourn for him as one mourns for an only child and weep bitterly over him as one weeps for over a firstborn. And so there, there was the prophecy and the fulfillment came in John 19, 34, but one of the soldiers pierced his side with a spear and once and at once there came out blood and water, which was proof that he had died. So there was this, this prophecy way back 500 and some odd years before uh, the, the actual crucifixion took place of what would happen that, that that body would be pierced with a sword. On behalf of Dan Hurst and the Open Club, 